Okay. Uh, I'm, I'm getting the best pint of Guinness oh, right. in the city. First off, are either of you guys werewolves? Uh, it's kind of a rude question. Uh, it, 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 as the book counsels, you know, secrecy is tantamount. So even if we were, we would never say we were. So, but for the record, no, we're not. How did you guys get involved documenting, you know, werewolves' lives and, and creating this uh, very helpful instruction manual? Lycanthropy, uh, the condition of uh, werewolfism, has profoundly touched both our lives, without getting too specific. And, uh, yeah. oh, hello. Ah, thank you. Cheers, guys. Thank you. I'm sure you've noticed, pop culture-wise, there's been a huge uh, surge in interest in werewolves. That can be very dangerous if someone actually is bitten by a lycanthrope and watches the movie Underworld and thinks he's going to be, I don't know, hanging out with hot women in skin-tight black leather. That's not the reality of the condition. Ignorance creates monsters, yes. lycanthropy does not. Mm. Right. Now, um, I thought we could maybe do a little bit of role-playing. Okay. Uh, where I am your wife, and, and you're coming out, to, you're telling me that you're a werewolf for the first time. Would you guys be up for that? Uh, sure. Great. Uh, honey, you know I love you. There's something that I need to tell you. You know how all my hair grew back? It wasn't the Rogaine. Now that's a good lead-in. It's not really any different than any other problem in any relationship. You need to be truthful with the person you love. Yes, you're turning into a 700-pound beast that will hunt and kill and can rip the head off a live ox. That's a problem. Right. Okay? So is adultery. Mm. Give me an example. You, you're, I'm your wife. Break the news to me. Sweetheart. Uh, I know... What, what is it? We, you look upset. Every 30 days. I physically transform into something very dangerous. I can't have you around for that. This doesn't, this seems like a lie. Are you lying to me? The fact that I am telling you this indicates that I will never lie to you again in my life. I love you very, very much. Let's get a toast for living healthily with lycanthropy. Thanks for living with lycanthropy. So, uh, wh who, who are you guys' favorite uh, alcoholic writers? Edgar Allan Poe is, is uh, great, huge drunk. J.K. Rowling. She's, uh, no, she's not a drunk. I don't, well, she could be. 